All right, so in this video, I wanted to go ahead and open the mid and the base uh, version of the boom boxes. I did the Elite in the Platinum already on the channel, so if you guys missed that, uh, check back and check it out. Uh, but this time, I wanted to open the lower tiers and see what we could get. Uh, honestly, there was a couple packs in each of the lower tiers that I was like, ah, I might as well give it a shot. So here is what it says the contents are. Uh, and I already took all the stuff out, the, the peanuts for this time, just because I was trying to get it. Uh, done quicker so we have uh, a couple interesting packs here one the uh yeah so this is uh, the space jam uh blaster pack then we have hoops 2021 and then hoops uh 1920 and then the don russ from a couple years ago which is nuts i think this is 16 14 15 and then uh then the mosaic fast break which is like kind of the biggest one uh for what you're you're doing here so kind of cool mix of stuff i figured we'd go ahead and get into that and then um on the other side we do have the mid and the mid has a couple different options here gotta get the uh one of these guys as well um not a, using those ones too much but interesting anyway we have this side which has don russ elite hobby recon hoops Revolution, Chinese New Year, and then Don Rose Hobby. So there's Recon, which I have opened one pack of. I don't know if you guys will see it on this channel yet before this video, but uh, I have that. And then also Revolution, but this is Chinese New Year, and I have a video on all three different revolutions coming to the channel, so subscribe if you haven't uh, thus far. Here's Elite, uh, which I like as well. I have a couple of unboxings of that. And then uh, Don Russ again, for the older year, and then both of the hoops. Actually, this is a different year, so this is uh 1920 and then this is 2021 so this one has a couple different so we have three years of hoops basically and then that don russ over here so excited to see where this side takes us uh excited to see where this side takes us with a fast break and here's kind of a, a look at april so if you guys like these videos drop a uh a like on the video and subscribe and i will do more of these in the future because uh, they are kind of expensive obviously especially since i've got four different tiers of this this april month but it was just kind of too fun to not do it i guess and the opportunities to get some and honestly what sold me on it is watching um pac-man's videos and then seeing him hit a one of one i'm like i need that i want that feeling uh anyway there's dom checkered board here and then bugs portraits and then taz and then daffy portrait no parallels in this i don't think can't really tell um these are very interesting very very interesting i don't know all right that was that we're moving on to actual cards here those i mean i like entertainment cards um and i saw that they do have some parallels in those but it must just be random uh anyway we have something blue just looks like a regular one here there's joel kongwu rosair or whatever clark city edition and we have the cole anthony and then tj for the rookie so i usually put the rookies and in inserts aside i think that one might be an insert and then uh this one will throw up here for the city cole uh, moving on we have the uh 1920 uh so next, this was before my time of ripping cards so actually i don't know this one at all but this isn't really cool looking looks like we got a silver in the back there Jackson, um, Aaron, and Deadman, and uh, Quinn Cook for that, and no rookie life. I like the premium stock though, it does say premium stock, it does feel premium, I can attest to that. But uh, yeah, that's what we're looking like there, unfortunately. I guess that's good ish, but if this is the best card I get, I'm gonna be sad. Um, no, just to uh, to call cold world over there but here we go the next this is 14 15 there's a lot of big rookies from this year it sounds like so hopefully we'll get uh just a base one of some or even better a nice parallel but or an auto let's shoot for the stars look at that young curry right there it's crazy what a couple years can do boston channing there's a chris paul Ooh, what is this what is this what is this please no pain napkin whoa Yo, that is a crazy on patch rated rookie. It's like a rated rookie patch. That's weird. And then a Chris Bosch Elite. So that's interesting. And then the rookies, CJ Wilcox. Um, Got to be honest, don't know if this guy's good or not. 
but really cool looking card. And I don't know if this is too thick, boy, to put in a thing, but that's a really cool patch. Is it say? I don't know if it's game worn stuff or not. Hmm. Really cool looking stuff here. I'll try to squeeze it in here without ruining my corners. That's wild. Look at that patch, though. And that's a rated rookie patch, so that's like, that was definitely something that uh, that they were doing, um, like as in Don Russ did. And then Wilcox here. Not the rookies I, I was hoping for, but still cool to see uh, some of the older stuff over here. And those three looked kind of cool. I'll put them over here and then just do a follow-up at the end. Actually, I'll put this one up here since it's so different. So there is one. Moving on, here is Fast Break, which can be insanely awesome or also very, very terrible. And it looks like we just have a regular disco for us. Unfortunately, no color discos, but hopefully it's somebody good. Uh, we have Bass, there's a Maxi, and then there's a Finals, and then a Will Barton. Will Barton to go and save the day. Will Barton. Not the one I was hoping for, for that. So that, I mean, that's where the cookie crumbles. But uh, that's one side. And then we can get into the other side now, now that all of that is out of the way. Uh, nothing too amazing across the board uh, on this side. But, uh, you know, we'll put you guys all over here. And uh, I don't know who's the best out of that. I mean, Bosch is cool. I guess this guy's probably... It is what it is. All right, we'll get into the, the mid now. And again, here we go. Here's what we're looking at into here. We're starting off with the hoops, 2021. So page year, current year. We're gonna see a lot of great products from this year coming up soon, which will be fun to see because I'm not sick of the stuff that I've been ripping, but it'll, it's just exciting to see the same rookies in different formats. So here is a Giannis Hoopla. I've never seen that parallel. Kind of cool, but kind of also uh, basic. And, uh, but cool, I guess. We'll leave it at cool. Mellow's year. So, trying to get like a mellow auto <laughs> or something in here. Something big, something big. Be big. DeRozan. Cat Daddy. Kimba. And Legends of the Game to 199. Shy. Uh, SGA. The guy is definitely a legend. He's, he's doing work, man. That's a good card. I'll take it to 199. Very decent in my mind. We have Vassal and then Mannion as well for the Rooks. And then, uh, man, this Don Russ old, old school year. Let's open this guy up. And then the last few packs I'm super stoked on because I really like all of the products that we're going to be looking at in Seattle Supersonics on this on the back. That's crazy to see. DeRozan again. It feels like he was the second card last time. Steve. And then we have DeMarcus Cousins. Ooh, 227. Two, Very odd numbering with another parallel for the Elite. And then Scoring Kings Dale Ellis. That's kind of a cool one. And blue. And it's kind of done on a different... Uh, cardstock too like the material on this one is kind of crazy i like that that's fun and then this one demarcus cousins um two two twenty seven very interesting number to have a run of but okay we'll do it we'll do it looks cool that's fun fun set fun set no um crazy rookies here though all right, we're moving on to the next. Uh, we'll do Elite, and hopefully, man, can you imagine if we got a rook, uh, rookie auto on this one? Oh, that one, that one looked like somebody pumped the bag on this one. Felt like it was ad adjusted, but obviously not. It looks like we got a die cut in here, red die cut maybe. All right, Davis, and we have a Kyle Kuzma to 99. So not a terrible card, not a terrible card. Nice color match. As you guys say, that's not bad at all. I'll take it. All right. I mean, this this side at least just feels like I'm getting a lot of numbered love. So definitely appreciating that. 
Um, and then I already looked at these ones. These are the last ones. So can we get another? Can we get a rookie or no? Doug, Bogdan, Rue, and that dude. So that's the way cookie crumbles usually get one insert in the entire pack. And I mean, obviously you've seen that for everything here, but sometimes it's good, sometimes it's okay. That one was okay. Um, all right. I mean, purple would have been better to 49 and then even better, you know, stuff could have been better than that. And it looks like we got a curry on the back there. All right, Revolution, and this is, I guess, a different version. What is it? Chinese New Year. So looks like parallels are in here. Base card. We have the Sadiq Bay, and this is a base card. Ooh, look at that. There's a LeBron. New Year LeBron. That's fire. I just love Revolution, to be honest. It's one of my favorite sets just the look of the, the cards are so fire check out that cracked ice new year lebron very very cool and a rightful spot up here that looks dope i don't know the value of any of the cards i put up there at all like literally not at all and there's a nice looking card too there with the the curry even though it's a base looks cool and then just for those that don't know if you look at the back top it will tell you whether or not it's a base or you know, a parallel or whatever. Uh, but no rookie. Yeah, Sadiq, I guess. And then that one. Um, all right. Not terrible. Then last but not least, Recon. These are Thick Boy card stocks. Hopefully we'll get a good one. I see I see a name on the back there. Hopefully that's real. Hopefully it's real back there. All right. There's Robert Covington. Look how thick these guys are. There's a... a um, UA, <laughs> as I always shortcut it there. That's a nice one. There's a cat. And we have uh, that dude in Precious for the rookie in the gold. And then we have the Rock the Rim Edwards. That's what I'm talking about. It's not numbered, though. The last time I actually got a, uh, a LeBron Rock the Rim that was numbered, I think it was numbered to 200. But, dude, I'll take a, uh, a rookie Edwards any day. That's got to be probably the best card if close to uh that i pulled today i like that definitely like that and then precious uh not terrible either i mean recon in general is just a fun fun set i've only opened like i mean i didn't even know what it was i saw it at the hobby shop shout out to my buddy jad and mentioned it and she said you should get one of those and it, it was overpriced it was like 40 instead of 30 a pack but i picked one of them up and was enjoyable to say the least so anyway let's recap uh, we can go ahead and uh, take a look at, at all of the different stuff here. Um, we'll start off with here with this, and then we'll get into the other side. So uh, these two rookies here for Recon. And then we got the Curry. I just like that one in the Sadiq Bay. Uh, Vassal, Nico. There's a Dirk uh, Elite. And then the Dale Ellis Scoring Kings. I remember that era. Super dope. I like that they give a little bit of uh, love and some, like, background on them as well. And then there's the Giannis Hoopla. So, interesting parallel there. But I think that one's the best from down there. And then we'll get into this side and we'll show you guys everything above. So, there's the Maxi, Mosaic Base, Space Jam, Checkerboard. And then we have TJ, not my favorites. You guys can go back here and sit down over there. There's Wilcox, Bosch, and then Quinn Cook in the Silver Parallel. Then we have the City Edition, Cole, and then a Will Barton in the Disco. Uh, then, finally, I think these all were from... I think all of these were from this side. I, I'm, I'm losing my mind. I can't remember. You guys will have to keep keep track for me. But Kyle Kuzma was definitely from this side. That one is 84 to 99. Then we have the production line, uh, DeMarcus Cousins. And this one is to uh, whatever... 220 something really random edwards rock the rim very good one probably the best one in my mind i don't even know the value again not looking them up and then uh, lebron james like that one and this is the new year parallel which looks very cool also legends of the game um shy i think this one was also on this side and then was this one the, yeah i think this is the only one that was actually from this side and this is the uh, adrian Payne with the rated rookie patch auto patch auto pretty crazy to see that something like that's not numbered but i'll take something different and that is the lineup for what we ended up getting um i don't know again 
which is which and i guess i can try if you guys want to stick around for one second i'll do this center stage thing and try my luck again but nine times out of ten it's not working so let's see <laughs> that's not even the right dude Kakuzma. no see we're, we're failing here let me let me try to uh look these up and i'll get right back to you guys all right, so I looked most of these up. I would say they probably go in order like this of value, to be honest. Uh, they're actually not worth that much, which is fun and also mm, disheartening because how much everything costs. But that's the way it always works out. Anyway, which way we have LeBron here, and this one is the New Year. Again, cool looking card. It's like around 10 bucks or so. It depends. This one's around the same price, honestly, close to that. 197 of 199 uh, SGA. Uh, this one, if it was numbered, it would be worth like 60 or 70 bucks, but it's not numbered. So it's like five or six dollars, unfortunately. Uh, but I feel like that one would, would have been a good card. Kyle's roughly around like five to eight dollars as well. And then this one, probably like less than five dollars. And then this one, less than five dollars, even though it looks kind of cool. And then uh, these guys are all less than five dollars. So that's the way the cookie crumbles sometimes. So got some fun ones, though. Happy to see some LeBron. And then uh, all, this one's a, a nice one as well. So I'm not mad at these three are probably my favorite cards uh, of the group. And then this one's a cool one. I just wish it was a better better rookie. But uh, let me know how you guys think I did if I missed any cards that were super, super awesome. Because I need them at this point. Uh, ultimately, it is the way it works out. You pay to play. And sometimes you win, sometimes you don't. And this one was okay, in my opinion. Fun, fun enough that I would do it again. Let's just leave it at that. But thank you guys for watching. Have a good one. And hopefully we'll see you back for some more rips. See you guys.